This is the practice exercise B and C found in your module number one. Here we are at we are tasked to place appropriate symbols on the blanks provided for. So let's start with letter B. In letter B, there are two sets given. Sets R, set R is a set of reptiles, and set M as a set of mammals. For number one, dog blank R, as we all know, that dog is not a reptile. So we choose the symbol for non-element like this. Or you could actually do it better in your own way. Number two, snake blank M as a set of mammals. We also know that snake is not a mammal. So we place the symbol for non-element. Turtle, if you have seen the movie Over the Hedge, it's clearly explained there that turtles are not amphibians, but turtles are reptiles. So we use the symbol element. Dolphin is a mammal, so we use the symbol element. And alligator is a reptile, not a mammal, so we use the symbol not an element. As for letter C, another two sets are given. First set E as a set of even numbers, and set W as a set of whole numbers less than six. Let me clarify and emphasize, set W talks about whole numbers less than six. So let's start. Number one, three blank E. Is three an even number? No, therefore we use the symbol, not an element. Number two, three blank W. Is 3 a whole number less than 6? Yes. So we use the symbol element. Number 4. Uh, sorry, number 3. Is 4 an even number? Yes. So we use the symbol element. Number 4. Is 4 an element of set W, the set of whole numbers less than 6? Yes. So we also use the symbol element. And lastly, for number five, is six a number less than six? Or better, is six a whole number less than six? No, so we use a symbol, not an element. Again, to emphasize, two symbols are given. This symbol, or we could do it better. This symbol is a symbol for element. Again. That symbol is a symbol for element or an element of a set. And the second, second symbol means it's the symbol for a non-element of a set. Okay, this is the end of this video. See you next time.